Hello everyone, welcome back to the map of mathematics. In this video, we are going to solve this nice system of equation problem. And here we have x plus y is equal to 5a and x minus y is equal to a and x y is equal to 18a and we will find the values of x, y and a. Okay, so we will find here these three values. So now we move toward the solution of this problem. So the very first thing we are going to do is here I will take this as equation number 1 and this as equation number 2 and this is the equation number 3. So the very first thing we are going to do is here first I will add equation number 1 and equation number 2. Okay so this is the equation number 1. I can write it as x plus y is equals to 5a and x minus y is equals to a so now when we add these two equations so these are cancel out and here we have 2x is equal to 5a plus a is equals to 6a and here we get the value of x is 3a and after that we will subtract the equation number 1 and equation number 2 so when we subtract these two equations x plus y is equal to 5a and x minus y is equals to a so when we subtract these two so these x are cancelled out each other and here we have y plus y 2a is equal to 5a minus a is equal to 4a so here we have sorry this is 2y so here we have y is equals to 2a so here we get uh, the values of x and y and the value of x is 3a and the value of y is 2a. So now we multiply the values of x and y. So xy uh, is equal to the value of x is 3a and the value of y is 2a. So here we have xy is equal to 6a square. And in the start of the question, we have equation number 3 xy is equal to 18a we will substitute the value of xy in this expression so here we have 18a is equal to 6a square so now we divide both sides by 6a so that this a are cancel out and this 6 3 is 18 so in the left hand side we have 3 and here we have a so the value of a is equal to 3 so now we substitute the value of a in x and y so here the finally we have x is equal to 3a and when we put the value of a here we get x is equal to 9 and we have y is equal to 2a and when we put the value of a here so we get the value of y is 6 so this is the our final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe my channel for more exciting videos